everyone, I'm Tazneem bringing you this week's movie review. With films like Gangs of Vasepur and Dev D, it's a well-known fact that director Anurag Kashyap comes from the school of realistic cinema, so his first commercial film is sure to be highly anticipated. Bombay Velvet stars some big names and mind-blowing visuals. However, does the film provide as much substance as it does opulence? Let's take a look at the review to find out. Bombay Velvet transports us to the newly independent India in the 1950s and 60s. The film tells the story of Balraj, played by Ranbir Kapoor, a young kid who participates in street fights and is looking for a way to make it big. Taking him under his wing is Kambara, played by Karan Johar, who turns Balraj into Johnny, a criminal who does what it takes to live a life of wealth. The film revolves around his journey and his passionate love for Rosie, a struggling jazz singer played by Anushka Sharma. With fantastic CGI, Bombay Velvet is visually stunning and on point. The sets and backdrops are very well done and look completely authentic, successfully adding that much needed realism to the film. The set designs as well as the soundtrack and costumes are the film's real strengths. But where there's grandeur, there must be an equally strong script to keep it engaging. With this film, Anurag Kashyap has finally made his transition transition from small budget films to an epic Bollywood thriller, and though the film promised a lot, it doesn't quite deliver. The director is a great storyteller as proven from his past films, but with Bombay Velvet, he seems to have lost his touch. The film starts off well as it manages to create and set the stage for a gripping tale of betrayal, murder, and love, but the second half completely loses steam and doesn't quite end on the exciting note that it began. Part of the reason is because the story loses focus post-interval and becomes very filmy and predictable. Ranbir Kapoor is a backbone of this movie and delivers an impressive performance. His zoot suit wearing Johnny is a man of extremes, whether it's his anger or his love, and Ranbir does a good job of playing a slightly crazy and obsessive man. Anushka Sharma looks beautiful in all her regal costumes. Her Rosie is a submissive sufferer of all the men who try to control her, and Anushka puts in a strong performance. Even her lip syncing is convincing. Anushka Sharma and Ranbir Kapoor's chemistry is excellent, and the two actors managed to convey the passion between Rosie and Johnny very well. Karan Johar as the master manipulator is good, though he's better off staying behind the camera. Bombay Velvet is a good period drama with enough visuals to excite any movie lover, but unfortunately doesn't have the story to keep the viewer engaged, and with its much too long runtime and a weak second half, it's getting two and a half stars on Showbiz India. Unfortunately, Bombay Velvet fails to live up to all the expectations. That's all for me for this week. Enjoy the rest of your Memorial Day weekend. Unfortunately, Bombay Velvet fails to live up to all the expectations. That's all for me for this week. Enjoy the rest of the show.